Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to have our week 5 battle against the Atlanta Braviaries uh, whose head coach is going to be Stone Family 64 So, very excited, very nervous for this battle, have been waiting for this. Um, we're going to go ahead and jump into a Discord call uh, with um, Stone in a few. Um, and then once... Um, and then once we get over the Discord call and everything, uh, so, assuming there are no audio issues, of course, uh, but once we do the audio or the Discord call, we're going to go ahead and go over his drafts, my predictions, and uh, then we're going to hop right into the battle. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, let's give him a call. Hello, hello, hello. Hey, how's it going, bro? It's going well. How are you? I'm nervous as heck. <laughs> Alright, at least I'm not the only one. <laughs> no. No. So, uh... Sorry I missed the call. I was actually... I made adjustments real quick. Ooh. Yeah. I made some last second decisions. Last second decisions. Alright. Yeah. yeah, so we'll see if it pays off. But I don't know. Okay. Just making sure that everybody here is set. No mistakes or anything. All right, all right. So I'm as ready as we'll ever be. So um, are we gonna include any of this in the video? How you wanna do it? Well, you know me. I'm uh, having audio issues all over the place since the beginning of the league. So if everything turns out fine on my end, once I review everything, I would love to keep. Uh, oh. Well. Give me one second. Oh. Uh -oh. Well, well, I'm not really streaming, so let me go ahead and set the switch to priority so I don't get disconnected. All right. So, all right. Uh, anyway, as I was saying, so, yeah, if there are no issues, uh, then I'll, I'll include it. If not, then you know why. <laughs> Good, that works out. All right. So, I'm assuming... Uh -oh. Huh? I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and uh, set up the code here. I'm assuming you want to do six four six four six four. Hey, that's cool. However you want to do it, I'm here for whatever, bro. Okay, so we'll just do your code. And G yeah, bro. Um, may the best battler win. I know you're gonna give a hell of a fight. Hey, I, like I said, I'm coming with a plan. And that plan or what was it? We gotta come over the plan of attack. I have a plan. Attack. I have a plan. Attack. Yeah, yeah. I have a, I have a plan too. Don't die. <laughs> Don't die. There you go. All right, bro. So when you watch my video, you're gonna love the intro. I'm telling you. Oh, I'm, I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to see it. Right, I'm searching. We'll disconnect and just reconnect when we uh, finish up. Sounds good. All right, man. I'll holler at you. All right. All right, guys. So, uh, assuming everything went well, um, just got off the phone with this uh, with uh, Stone. We're gonna go ahead and jump into the battle right now, as you guys can see. Um, ooh, I didn't really give time for my predictions. Um, so, while he's waiting there, we're gonna go ahead and do that now. Actually, have my little notebook. Um, and as far as Stone goes. My predictions are the following. My predictions are the following. Uh, I know he's going to bring Dialga and Reuniclus hands down because he needs those two. Um, I have a feeling he might bring the Conkelder and the Mamoswine, the Lapras, and maybe Aegislash. I don't know if how many how many I said there. I'm reading this thing wrong. Okay, so Mamoswine, Dialga, Reuniclus, Conkelder. Uh, Lapras and Aegislash. And if he doesn't bring the Aegislash, he might bring the Vile Plume. And this time, I'm expecting him... Hopefully, I'm right with my little notes right here. But I'm expecting him to actually G-Max the Lapras. So he can set up screens. So let's see. Hopefully, with what I have... Hopefully, what I have... Um, you know... Is it's good. Hopefully, with what I have is good. 
So these are my guys. I'm bringing Scizor. Excuse me, guys. I'm bringing Scizor, Shuckle, Venusaur, Toxapex, uh, Ace, and Rayquaza. Let's let the battle begin. Let's let the battle begin. Ooh, he brought the Volcar. Okay. Okay. He did not bring the Conkelder. This is interesting. Okay. He brought the Vile Plume. Bought the Mamoswine. Lapras. Aegislash. Volcarona. And he brought the uh, Dialga. Off the bat, I know I have to get rid of the Volcarona. Volcarona is going to be. Uh, it's going to be crazy. So I'm going to go with Ace first. Hopefully I get to spook him a little bit. If he doesn't if he doesn't bring the Volcarona out first turn, or I don't know. We'll just have to play it by air, I guess. I don't really have a plan. <laughs> uh, my plan is to not die. My plan is to not die. Gonna go ahead and switch this to performance mode. Um, so that, you know, the recording doesn't stop. Call mine. Let's do this. Okay, I figured he would start with the Dialga. I figured he would start with the Dialga. And I have a feeling he's either going to do Trick Room or he's going to set up Rocks. And that's kind of what I wanted. Not the Rocks, of course, but I was hoping he would start off with the Dialga. Hopefully my plan goes well. I just realized something. He did, I don't think he brought the Reuniclus. Unless someone else in this team knows um, Trick Room. In any case, rocks have to come first. Rocks have to go first. Because that Volcarona is going to be a problem. <laughs> this guy. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is going to be one good match. I need the sand tomb to hit. I need sand tomb to hit. Come on. Stay in. Okay. That's not what I wanted. Chip damage. Okay, new strategy. We'll toxic it. We'll intoxicate it. I know it's going to live whatever it's going to throw us. Hopefully it does. This is one strong shuckle. Okay. Yes, yeah, psychic. We're going to have to wait it out. 
maybe he, oh but he can't uh he can't swap out there you go so this thing is just gonna get worse and worse unless shuckle dies Can't swap, dude. You're gonna have to attack. Okay. Does he not have any water moves? Special defense rose. Contrary shuckle, baby. Yeah, this I gotta tell you, this Lapras is probably one of the ones that I was really afraid of. Okay, never mind. He has a water move. I guess he was trying to whittle it down until. Okay, makes sense. Makes sense. All right. Ooh, a crit. And he goes down here. I'm going to predict he is coming out with the Dialga. Hopefully he does. Maybe he wants to set up Trick Room. Oh, okay. I wonder what you have. Whatever it is, I don't like you. You are going to be a problem. Bunker was originally brought in to wait out that Lapras, but I guess Shuckle did it. We're both one and one. Okay, he's staying in, I think. Oh no, he's not. Okay, we both withdrew. And he brought out the flower. I wonder if we can get a burn. Burn? Yay, we got the burn. Sorry, Matt, I'm sorry. It's not going to do anything, but at least we'll whittle its health down little by little. I wonder if you have Moonblast on that thing. I can't risk Ace. Poison's not going to do too much damage to Venusaur. Scizor, you're up the bat.
Okay, he withdrew that. Mothra. Okay. I wonder. We're going to have to take this out. Jesus. Did it it's ra it raised its special attack, special defense and speed. Let's go for E speed. All right, that's down. Burn. God damn it. Okay. Adjust. Adjust. Kind of wish I had a lumberry. <laughs> oh, poor Rayquaza. You're so prone to burns. Alright, we're still faster. We are still faster, so... We're going to overheat it and let Rayquaza go down with this one. We're going to let Rayquaza down, uh, go down. Overheat, please. <laughs> oh, poor Rayquaza. That's cool. That's fine. That's fine. That's mighty fine. All right, Rayquaza. Wait, what? I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure he didn't mean to do that. But sorry, bro, we're going to have to take advantage of that. All right, now Requiz can go down. Still has not Dynamaxed. Well, he still is not Dynamaxed, so I gotta keep that into account. He can't G Max the Lapras because Lapras went down, Mammal went down, Volcarona went down. So he's probably going to G-Max uh, the Dynamax at Dialga. Cleaver. You're going to use King's Shield. No, you're not. Okay. Interesting. I wonder who you're going to use. Okay. 
That might do some damage. That was a crit. Stance change. Shadow Claw. That was that was okay. I hate to do it. I hate to do it. Stealth rocks damage. Yep, you use King Shield. It's not going to work, though. I mean, it's going to protect them, but it's not going to lower my attack. Okay, it hits. Dialga. Two mons left. Ways of going down messed me up a wee little bit. Alright, I'm gonna sacrifice Scizor. If he lives, great. If he doesn't, he doesn't. But I'm gonna sacrifice Scizor. He's going to use Trick Room here. Ooh, that was smart. He's going to use Trick Room here. This is going to go to time. This is going to go to time. I wonder if I can get a burn. No burn. Futile, but hey.
Definitely has me on the run now. He played really well. Got to protect him a little bit. Matt played this really well. He really played this well. This went to time. Okay. Got to protect Ace. Second loss. That's cool. Got to raise our defense, too. Matt played really well. I'm very happy for that. He played really well. 12 seconds. I did. Okay. All right. No problem. GG's. GG's. I'm, I got to say, I'm very happy. I'm very happy. I'm happy. Um, Matt has definitely come a long way. Um, it was good. It was good. GG's, my, uh, Matt. Uh, let's go ahead and quit. Cancel. Um, let's go ahead. Yeah, let's go ahead and answer this call real quick. Yo. Listen, I gotta say I'm sorry too. Um, <laughs> in my concentration with the battle, I forgot to say mother chicken. <laughs> I did too. I forgot to say it too. Don't worry. Don't worry. Here, so I'll, okay. I'll make sure because I'm recording your audio. Uh huh. So go ahead and say it now for the fans, and I'll say it all the way. Mother chicken. Flat <laughs> jacks. All right. But that was such a good battle, dude. I'm it gonna... really was. It really was. I'm I'm very happy. I'm very happy. Is Pyro Ball not physical? It is a fair it's, it's it's a physical move, but it doesn't do direct contact. That's why King Shield doesn't work. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh okay. that's why King Shield so doesn't work. Be, it's gotta be direct contact. Correct, correct. I gotta tell you, Rayquaza going down messed me up. But uh, listen, GG's, this was an intense battle. This is probably the, one of the most intense battles that I've had throughout the whole league. And I couldn't be happier. I gotta, I gotta honestly tell you, I couldn't be happier. I mean, I, I didn't think I'd win. I hate that I won by timer, because I honestly believe two more minutes in that battle, and you, you got it. No, bro. You, know, because, you had me on the run. Spike, well, that skill spike, though. Your defense was up. There was nothing I could do from that point, because all I had left was a bio pool. And I was like, oh, this sucks. <laughs> and you could see, hopefully, you could tell by how quickly I was picking moves that I was not trying to run timer on you. Because I, I, I really don't want you to think I was like, okay, I'm just going to stall him and run timer. I was literally clicking the moves as quick as I could. Uh, the thought never crossed my mind. However, um, and for everybody watching, um, your predictions were right, Matt. Uh, our battle did go to timer. I didn't. I, said it would. I, I really didn't did. think. I didn't think that it would. I didn't think that it would, and I stand corrected. But it went to timer, and I mean, it is what it is. Honestly, I'm very happy. You have come a long way with 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 the with the battling. Whoever trained you, whoever helped you, uh, and everything. You did a great job. I'm 
saluting you right now on camera. I'm saluting you. You did a great job, and I'm very happy with this. I'm pleas I'm trust me, I'm happy. I, w I wonder who my coach was. <laughs> I wonder who that could be. I have a feeling I know who it is. But hey, I will tell you, uh, I predicted five of your six months. Did you? Yeah. Nice. So I have a whole little book. Um, that I went through and I even wrote down strats on what I would do. So, yeah. <laughs> so I predicted the Mammoth Swine. I had three possible scenarios in which you could have went. Um, I predicted the Mammoth Swine, Dialga, Reuniclus. I thought you were going to bring Kinkelder. Um, I knew you were going to bring Aegislash and Lapras. Oh, excuse me. Rayquaza scared Conkelder out. <laughs> Rapidash was a possible bring in, because, and, but uh, your Toxapex and Venusaur scared her out, and I was like, Psychic Fairy, even if I get hit with a poison move, I'm still going down. And then uh, Reuniclus, I didn't honestly see how it helps me with your other four besides Toxapex and Venusaur, but I didn't think you were bringing Toxapex, so I only saw Reuniclus needed for Venusaur. And mm -hmm. I was like, I've got other stuff that can handle this. Okay. Okay. But I brought. I, I had everything except for your Toxapex. In place of Toxapex, I had Swampert. Interesting. Okay. Because I, I didn't really have much except for the um, Bioplume, in my opinion, to, to handle Swampert. So I was like, if he gets rid of Bioplume and he brings Swampert, he can get a shot for that. Hey, I want to tell you your Shuffle at the beginning. Mm hmm. Kind of really pissed me off because I was like he's got to switch he's got to switch because I didn't think you were going to let Shuckle go down I was yeah that was I, I kept hitting sidekick thinking you were going to go into like Toxapex or Venusaur because you were going to think that I was going for Surf or something and I was like if I hit sidekick he's going to he's not going to want to take this you know what's funny finally, is I was like screw it Surf <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because um I, I was wondering, when you kept hitting Psychics after Psychics, I'm like, wait, th does this Lapras not know a water move? You'll hear that in the video, too. <clears throat> no, I knew a water move. I just, I literally was like, okay, he's not going to, because I was like, what's he doing? What's he going to do with this shuffle? And then I go, okay, he's going to switch. And then you didn't switch, so I was like, okay, now he's going to switch. And you didn't switch again, and I'm sitting here like, you know what, screw it, sir. <laughs> <laughs> But great battle. You did amazing. Uh, I do wish we could have played it out. I do think you would have won if we played it out because of your defense raises. Because there's no way by my vile plan to your Cinderace. But, I, have a, uh, I, have a, I have one question that I need to know. Yeah. Did that Dialga carry Trick Room? It did. I, I'm On the last turn of... Um, I had a feeling you were going to do it on the last turn. On, well, on the last turn of uh, Dynamax, couldn't click trick room because it would just be max guard mm. so my thought process and it literally I, I hit the button to attack and I go you're an idiot because you could have set up trick room and possibly still knocked him out because you don't know if he actually re has got recovered on that toxic I did, I, did. And I figured you did but and then the recover you could have stalled out the trick room that, but yep, but too. yeah, um, it have been stall fest right there, and then we're just running the time right I the <laughs> moment, the moment you Dynamax Dialga, um, towards the end, I thought, okay, he has Trick Room, he's got me down to my last mon. This was a smart play. This was really smart. So uh, your, your back still spike tripped me up because. All season, I've seen you U-turn, uh, whatever the flying type move, because I've only seen you use Max Airstream. I haven't paid attention to what flying type move it is. Acrobatics. Pyro, pyro Ball. So I'm sitting here like, okay, all I've got to do is click Stone Edge, and this dude goes down. And then you throw out the steel, and I'm like, he's steel type now. Frick. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know the Cinderace got a steel type move. But, I mean, it was, it was a perfect battle in my opinion. Yeah. The the steel type move was reserved for Lapras because the steel, it, no matter nothing that Lapras oh, throw yeah. threw at it, it's not gonna overcome the steelness, you know. Yeah. That so makes sense. yeah. That makes sense. Um, 
I didn't. I this entire time I was thinking of I'm, I need to counter his Lapras. I need to counter the Vile Plume. I thought Venusaur would handle Dialga, and then Venusaur went down, and I'm like, okay, crap. Um, that's not gonna work. So. Dialga was the counter for Ace, more more so than Ace Slash was. But um. Saturday, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So again, Matt, thank you for an amazing battle. It was a complete honor battling you. I had a ton of fun. I was thank nervous. You for a great Go ahead. Thank you for a great season. <laughs> thank you, my friend. Thank you for hey, this whole also, EBL, man. I would like to announce right now mm -hmm. because Cinderace lived with a plus one, depending on the other battles. Ace the Cinderace. Could possibly not be our MVP this season, guys. With how good it's been, it's still got a shot not to be MVP. I don't so, think he got any kills, did he? I can't remember. Yeah, well, no, he killed Age of Slash. Oh, he killed Age of Slash. Okay. But he, but he, did, and he didn't die, so he's still plus one. So he's looking at a plus twelve for the whole season. But uh, Crobats has Kyogre, which has not died except for once. Mm -hmm. he, he's got a possibility of getting higher than plus 12. But, um... <clears throat> go ahead. I'm gonna head out and do my intro, my outro. And then if you want, we can hop back and call to continue talking. Yeah, for sure. I'll call you. I'll call you a bike. Alright, man. I'll holler at you in a second. Alright. Alright, guys. So, um... We lost. <laughs> Again, but... Uh, this one, this one was cool. I, I enjoyed this one a lot. Um, Stone has come a long way from the beginning of the season uh, to now. Um, the season has been amazing. Um, I, I'm still lost with the whole rankings and everything, the whole calculations. I just leave that to, to, to Josh and to Matt and all that stuff. I just take it as they come. So we'll see. We'll see where this leaves us. Um, Hey, what matters is that I had fun in this battle. I truly had fun. Um, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. Make it turn blue. Subscribe to the channel for more Pokemon, Breath of the Wild, Assassin's Creed content. The EBL, or the Elite Battle League Season 2 has been confirmed. The draft will start sometime in the future. Um, so stay tuned for that. We will come back. And we're going to try harder than ever. I'll see you guys next time.